Hey everyone, this is Andrew Tai and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to install Proton GE, which is Proton Glorious Egg Roll, which is a more experimental version of Proton, which Valve does not include on the Steam Deck, but which you can install. It includes various libraries that Valve does not have access to, and so it can often run games. For example, Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga is going to run much better under Proton GE. So I'm going to show you how to go ahead and install that now. If you haven't subscribed already, then please consider subscribing. It only takes a moment to do, and you'll be able to keep up to date with the latest gaming news. So what we need to do first is press the Steam button here and then we're going to go to power and then we're going to switch to the desktop mode. So once we're in desktop mode we're going to go and click on the discover center so we can install a piece of software. So what you can do here is press Steam and X and then that's going to open up the virtual keyboard. Then we're going to do a search for something called Proton-QT. So I'm click on this then we're going to go ahead and press the install button. So once that's downloaded, we're going to go ahead and press the launch button here. And basically this is the main window. It's detected that we have an installation of Steam and what we're going to do is to press add version. And then we're going to go ahead and allow the latest version of Proton GE 7-14, which is the latest at the time of recording, and then press install. So that's going ahead and downloading now. So now that this is installed, you can go ahead and click on Proton GE 7.14. You can even go ahead and click show game list and it's gonna show which version of Proton certain games are using. So for example here, we can also set Star Wars Lego The Skywalker Saga. We can set this one to use the latest version of Proton. And we can even do things like add Proton to other launchers, for example, Lutris, Heroic, Heroic Proton, etc. But today we're just gonna use this on Steam. And what you can even do is to go ahead and double click. You can even select multiple games and update them all to use later versions of Proton. If we return to gaming mode, I can show you how to launch this from within gaming mode as well. So we can go to our library and then we can find our game. And then if we want to use Proton GE, if we haven't selected it already, we can go ahead and press the cog button here. And then we can go to properties and then we go to compatibility. So now we can go ahead and select Proton GE or any other versions of Proton in the past. And now when we launch the game, it's gonna run properly. So as you can see, the game runs great. We're running it at 1280 by 800 with medium and low settings on the graphics side. So as you can see, this game runs fantastically at 60 FPS. This is all thanks to Proton Glorious Egg Roll and all of the new compatibility and fixes that this can offer. So anyway, I hope you found this video useful. I've got lots of other Steam Deck tutorials like this on my YouTube channel, so please check it out. If you like the video, please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.